Hi, it's Jennifer. I am trying to do you guys the perfect daily vibe. And it seems like the messages are repeating. It seems, you know, they're, they're coming out in different words, whatever. You know, and I'm trying to just, you know, change it up a little bit. So we're going to see what, I'm just going to grab a couple cards and see what comes out here. Queen of Swords, you need to stick up for yourself. You need to look at something from a new perspective. You need to make a decision. You need to be decisive. You need to be logical. The High Priestess, follow your intuition at this time. You know what you need to do. You do. Whatever, whatever you're questioning, you know the answer. The answer is within you. You're seeing the situation absolutely clearly. You know. You know. Whatever you're questioning, you have that answer. You're, there's so much clarity here. You know exactly what is going on. Okay, whatever is happening, there's no, there's really, there's, there's, there's no, there's no question about it. Your inner, your intuition has that answer. You may be restraining yourself from moving forward with your intuition, but I'm telling you right now that your intuition has the answer. We got two. Oh, is it about love? It is about love, isn't it? The Four of Coins. This is about holding on. Stubbornness. Somebody is holding on to what they know but not taking action. Scared of the change. Scared of what they feel. Scared of love. Oh, well, okay. The Awakening. This is the hangman stuck in limbo. Like a new perspective is big here. You need to look at this through new eyes, through through new lenses. Okay, whatever it is that's keeping you stuck, you need to see it from a new perspective. You may you are definitely resisting change. Somebody that is watching this, whoever this is for, is resisting, you know, following their heart, being cold and bitter. Their intuition is telling them to you know, what they love, but they're not taking action. Yeah, somebody's in complete denial, even though they know what they need to do. Sitting on the fence, refusing to accept what they know, but there's true love here. Refusing to communicate, refusing to take action. Oh my God. You know, you could be dealing with a Pisces. We got Pisces on both ends, the same card. The high priestess can also represent Pisces as well. Somebody is is really, really stuck on a decision that they need to make. Unable to communicate, although they're in love. There is love. There absolutely is. There's a lot of stubbornness here. The four of coins is a very stubborn, stubborn energy. Stubborn. Somebody is sacrificing love. Because they're cold. They're cold. Their intuition is telling them to have faith and trust. To move forward. To take that blindfold off. And to do the right thing. There's an opportunity for a beautiful. Loving connection here but somebody is too stubborn to step down and take action Master of non-attachment. 
but I really want love. It's intense. It's very intense. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius up there. Um, I will bury myself in everything but love to mask the pain. But it hurts like hell. Refusing to see that two of cups, refusing to see the opportunity waiting when there is love. Hmm. So I feel like today there is a day, it is a day where somebody is being called to follow their intuition and offer love. or re or <clears throat> accept love but in order to do that you're gonna have to let go of resent you're gonna have to let go of bitterness and there is resent and bitterness here and you're gonna have to stop stop holding on to emotional detachment somebody has is remaining emotionally detached to protect themselves King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Detached, withdrawn, cold, gone cold. Why? There's conflict. There's undesirable news coming in. Somebody is seeing something they don't want to see. And it hurts. There's some sort of deception. There's cheating. There's lies. There's betrayal. Refusing. There's a lot of hurts. There's a lot of... Uh, Shady shit going on behind the scenes. And it's like, it's a big back and forth. I hurt you, you hurt me. I hurt you, you hurt me. <laughs> Master of denial. Ruthless behavior. All based on hurt, resent, and bitterness. Somebody needs to take the lead and stop playing games. 